Good morning and thank you for tuning into the Campus Weather Service. I'm student meteorologist Ryan Bells here with your Wednesday, April 3rd forecast. To begin off our forecast, we're going to take a look at this beautiful sunrise over State College this morning courtesy of our Mount Nittany Sky Cam. We can see that currently here in State College, we have a temperature right around 27 degrees. Feels a little chillier out there. Feels like 20 degrees as you're headed out this morning because we do have a slight wind out of the west northwest at six miles an hour. But look at this gorgeous view of Mount Nittany this morning. As we continue along with our forecast, we can see, looking at our weather almanac, today's high is supposed to be right around 43 degrees. We're still slightly below our average. Our average this time of year is right around 56 degrees. But take a look at this. Our low temperature expected for this evening is right around 21 degrees. Our record low, though, set back in 1943 was 20 degrees. So we could be flirting with a record low tonight. So stay tuned for that. As we take a look at our radar and satellite across the Commonwealth, we can see that in Scranton, Williamsport, and State College, we're all sitting right at 27 degrees this morning with partly cloudy conditions. A little chillier up in Bradford, 22 and 30 up by the Lake in Erie. But if you want to see some action this morning on the radar, let's take a flight from here at KUNV down to New Orleans, Louisiana, where they are having some thunderstorms this morning down here in the southeast. And as we can see by taking a look at the satellite and radar down there, from anywhere from New Orleans to Jackson, Mississippi, to Houston's just getting out of it now. They're pushing out of Houston, but there are some strong to severe th storms expecting throughout the day down there. So do be careful if you are living in those neck of the woods. But across the rest of the nation this morning, it does look to be generally quiet with the exception of the southeast here. Partly cloudy back in our neck of the woods, but other than that, nothing too major to speak about. Let's take a look at temperatures across the nation this morning. We can see 60s in the south, 68 in Tampa, 64 in New Orleans, 67 in Corpus Christi. As we take a look to the northeast, Roanoke sitting at 34 degrees, Buffalo a little chillier, 26 degrees, International Falls, the ice box, chilly, 6 degrees this morning, and out west we're sitting in the mid 40s to upper 50s, 45 in Salt Lake City, 46 in Portland, Oregon, and 56 down in Los Angeles this morning. As we advance it through, we're going to take a look at our Eye in the Future forecast. Stopping the clock this afternoon, right around 4 o'clock, we're still under partly cloudy conditions for the remainder of your day. And throughout the evening hours tonight and into your day tomorrow, it does look to be a very nice day in store tomorrow with clear conditions, mostly sunny skies, 7 a.m. to start off your day. And that'll linger throughout the day as by the noontime hour, we'll see mostly sunny conditions and it looks like a gorgeous spring day in store tomorrow. Throughout the day, Thursday and into Thursday evening, we do start to see this system from the southeast start to affect parts of the Commonwealth. We might see a stray shower throughout the day on Friday, Friday morning, 6.30 in the morning. Throughout the day on Friday, there's possibility of a stray shower. Nothing too major to speak about, though. And then as we advance it through Friday evening, right around 8.30, that system that will bring a chance of a shower will clear right out of the area and will be left with clear conditions for your Friday evening. Throughout the remainder of Friday evening and looking into early morning Saturday, 3 a.m., still clear conditions across the Commonwealth. So the forecast for today looks like a few clouds to start off your morning, 34 degrees. We'll warm up to right around 43 degrees this afternoon with mostly sunny conditions. And by 8 o'clock tonight, it looks to be partly cloudy with a low temperature right around 37 degrees. Your forecast for this evening calls for partly cloudy conditions just like I said, with a low temperature right around 21 degrees. And as I stated earlier in our forecast, we could be flirting with a record low because our record low is 20 degrees for this evening. Winds out of the northwest at 10 to 15 miles an hour. Still a little breezy out there. And your forecast for tomorrow does call for sunny conditions. Finally, it looks like a nice day in store. Temperature right around 52 degrees. Very nice spring day, so get out there and enjoy the weather. And now let's take a look at your seven-day planner. So for today, it looks to be mostly sunny, temperature right around 43 degrees. Thursday, we'll have abundant sunshine, 52 degrees. And ending the work week, we'll be in the upper 40s to low 50s with a chance of showers on Friday. Sunny conditions return on Saturday. And we'll warm up for the end of the weekend and looking to the beginning of next week to the upper 50s and even possibly hitting 60 degrees on Monday. Slight chance of a shower on Sunday, can't rule out. But other than that, looks like it's going to be a nice weekend and beginning of your next work week. That's all from the Campus Weather Service. We'd like to thank you for tuning in. For the most up-to-date forecast, check out campusweatherservice.com. Have a great day.